In this bamboo rod building video, we're going to focus on the initial bevel for initial planing. The end goal here is to take the strips that we pan split and form them into perfect equilateral triangles. We're not going to have a taper in these sections yet. We're just going to have perfect equilateral triangles, 60 degrees the entire length of these sections. I take these strips and I pretty much just hand plane down the edges to get myself a, a smooth working surface and I start the angle to get myself towards a triangle. Once I get myself a working surface, I'll move over to my maple rough forms, which is just a hard piece of maple. Get the straightest one you possibly can at the lumber yard. It's been planed down, so it's very flat. I've got a 60 degree groove routed through the entire length of the form. The final dimensions of this, the butt sections in this rod are going to be around 320 thousandths. So each one of these strips has to be half of that, 160 thousandths. That's going to be the widest point of this rod. It will eventually be tapered from that wide point down narrower. But for this section, we want to be at least above that 160 thousandth final dimension. So what I'll actually do is plane them down to somewhere around 190 thousandths, 200 thousandths, so that I have meat on the bone still to keep working in my future steps. Uh, the key here is sharp plane blades. This is the strips that we split by hand in earlier episodes and started to straighten, and I'm just going to hold the plane at a slight angle to give myself a little bit of a 60 degree type triangle being formed, and I'm just planing very lightly. I'm just taking off high points, I've got myself a working area right there. And I'll just go through this entire strip the same way. So I've got my maple rough form on the workbench. An animal side facing down for the time being. I'm just going to start taking off some cane. You can already see that the triangle is starting to come together. Okay, I've now used the maple rough form to get down to my desired dimension so far, which is about 200 thousandths. If I form them together, my sections together here, to form a butt rod section, you can already see the triangles and hex rod form coming together. And from here we're going to complete our rough planing in the steel planing forms. The steel planing forms are high quality precision machine to push pull screws so you can set the depth to create a rod taper. But for right now we're just completing the rough planing at this stage, so we're going to still um, plane down to one equilateral triangle dimension across the form. So I'm going to start getting a little bit more precise though. We're going to set and calibrate a depth gauge, and we're going to set this planing form to 195 thousandths to complete the rough planing of our butt sections. Okay, tool's been calibrated. good. Check it with my machinist gauge. Pretty good. A little bit of correction going to be needed in the final planing, but not very much. Now check it with the micrometer. Looking for around 195 thousandths. 195. 195. 
195. Can't get much better than that, 195 thousandths. We've completed the rough planing of our butt strip sections using the steel form now. All six strips have been formed down to equilateral triangles. When I form it together, we're getting a nice hex rod formation already. I'll move on to the tips, completing in the same manner just to a slightly smaller diameter, a slightly smaller spec. And we're still on our way.